Hello there, this is Jet Master Daniel 96 and in today's video I will be reviewing The Mandalorian Chapter 20 titled The Foundling and I will do the usual, give you a basic plot summary and then give you my thoughts near the end and then talk about certain things from the episode. So let's get to it. So with this episode of The Mandalorian, it's titled The Foundlin. I mean, there are two Foundlins in this. I mean, obviously we have Grogu, and we do get his flashback, like, during Order 66, during the events of Star Wars Episode Three: Revenge of the Sith. And then, you know, the Jedi that saves him from the temple during Order 66, you know, in The Purge is a Jedi, and the Jedi is played by Ahmad Best, who, you know, played Jar Jar Binks in the prequel trilogy, and even had a cameo as a different character in the bar in Attack of the Clones, and it was nice to see Ahmad Best, you know, return to Star Wars, and this was obviously the big one that we were all anticipating, and then, you know, Ahmad Best, you know, did the Jedi temple challenge thing a few years ago so i mean it's kind of good he's getting back in the star wars you know groove and like seeing the positivity surrounding you know ahmad best you know because you know when the phantom menace came out he got a lot of hate for jar jar and i mean it was just you know people being ignorant and all that and jar jar binks isn't a bad character as people make him out to be and seeing Ahmad Best, you know, getting the positive positivity here in 2023 was, I know, you know, pretty good, and I did think he deserved all the positivity, and articles are saying, oh, he's been redeemed, and it's not really a redemption, it's not the right word, like, I feel like it's just showing the love he deserved, you know, because he did deserve better after all that fan backlash he got back in, you know, 99 and all that stuff. So it was, you know, nice to see him get all the love and all that stuff. And then this is pretty much the big, you know, show stealer with Ahmad Bess returning. So that is, you know, pretty much, I think, all our highlights for this episode. And with us, you know, from the prequel generation like me, we are living in a good time, you know. For us who grew up with the prequels, it is kind of nice that we are, you know, getting that renaissance sort of thing. You know, it's like the prequels are getting better received these days, which is cool as well. So, little tangent right there. So, I just wanted to get that out of the way because that was the big one. And, I mean, we do have the other family who has Vizsla's son. So, we have that part there. He gets, you know taken from a bird at first he's you know doing some training with Grogu and all that and he loses to Grogu and then that's after that he gets taken by the bird and then they have to go get him so Din, Bo, and Paz and all these other Mandalorians pretty much have to go get him and stuff from this bird and at the end they get the baby birds and all that after they get Paz Vizsla's son, and then that's pretty much the episode. And then we see a bit where Bo-Katan gets a, you know, new shoulder blade, and it's a one of a, um, what do you, a Mythosaur, which is pretty cool. And even Boba Fett has a Mythosaur on his shoulder blade as well. So I just wanted to point that out. And that's pretty much a brief rundown of this episode. And it was... An enjoyable episode, and as I did say earlier, that the Ahmad Best appearance did steal the show here, and we pretty much all agree here, and that does it for me in this video. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, comment what you think down below. Um, did you like this episode, not like this episode? Let me know all that down below. Share this video, let's get to 600 subscribers. Um, follow me on Twitter, DanRS87, Instagram, JMD96 underscore YT, Facebook, JamMasterDaniel96. Have a great day, and may the Force be with you, and this is the way, and stay bomb bad. And another thing I'd like to add, that when I, during when Chapter 19 came out, I was a guest on the Bombadcast, so I will link that down below as well. So, there you have it.